Hi guys, I'm back. Miss Tana here and I have an art project for us. I'm going to show us how to paint tulips using forks. Tulips are a kind of flower that comes out in early spring. I have some growing in my yard right now and I've seen a few pop up in the last couple days so it's been a lot of fun to um, see the flowers grow and you might notice them on your walks or um, whatever. And so I'm gonna show you how to do this. Here we go. Here is what my paint palette looks like. I've wanted to do some different colors for my flowers. You don't have to have multiple colors. You can do one color. You can see I have a couple reds, couple pinks, and then a yellow with orange, just because a lot of times tulips have more than one color in it. But you can just do one solid color and it's fine. And we're mostly just going to use a fork today and you can see where is my fork you can see that I'm just using the back side of a fork I have a plastic fork but really you could use any kind of fork I just thought it would be easy to throw it away when I was done once you have your palette ready or whatever you're using to hold your paints um, you can get started. You can do this on a table. You don't have to do this upright on an easel. I just thought it might help me show um, the how we're doing it a little bit easier. So I have my palette with my paints, and I'm gonna grab my whoops, I'm gonna grab my forks, and I have one for each different color that I'm gonna do. So I'm gonna dip the back of the fork into the paint, and I want to get a lot of paint on there. I want to really fill it up, okay? And I'm just gonna go like that. And that's my first flower. And I'm gonna do a couple in this color. Here we go. Maybe four of them, I think. Okay, and I'm gonna put that fork down. Take my neck, this is my pink fork, so I'm gonna Dip it in the pink, and remember, I want to get a lot of paint on there, okay? You can see that there's a lot of paint. I'm going to do some of the pink flowers now. Okay, going to be done with pink. Now I've got red. Get a lot of paint on there. I want to make some happy flowers for spring. Today is kind of a rainyish day, and I know that the rain is going to help our flowers grow, and that will help me stay happy because I love flowers. I like to go on walks and I like to look around at the different flowers and plants that I see in the yard or in the trails where I go and it's a lot of fun. Okay so once you have the flowers that you want um, on your paper I'm gonna go to my paint brush that I have right here and I've got some green and I'm just gonna Just put some stems. My brush is a little firm. I had some paint on it earlier and it dried, so it's not as smooth as I would normally like. But basically, you just want to put some stems on the flowers. The stems are the long stick like thing that. The plants grow from usually the stems are green some stems are thick and strong some stems are thin and bendy so depending on the plant they have different stems generally I think most stems are green and they grow out of the ground from the dirt so we know that the water we're getting today in rain is going to help our plants grow. And what else will help our plants grow? Maybe some sunshine, um, 
good soil or dirt will help your plants grow. Lots of things. You can put some leaves. I'm almost out of green paint. Put some leaves on your tulips. But you can use your tulip paintings for a lot of different things. You can make paintings just for fun. You can um, paint things for other people and help them be happy. You can make stories from your paintings. So many fun things to do. But today, here we go, I'm on this side now. Today, I showed you how to paint with forks and how to make some tulips, one of my favorite flowers. And I love them because they come out early spring and they are so many fun colors and just makes me happy to see the flowers and the plants again after a long cold winter. So here we are, tulips. I'd love to see some pictures of what you guys end up painting. Okay, here are some more things that I did with my fork flowers. Um, this is a stand-up card that you can use for a prop for storytelling or for just if you want to make a little garden on your shelf or on your table, you can just fold the paper over. Here is a card that I made and I'll probably give it to my mom for Mother's Day and I just grouped the flowers a little closer together and then after the paint was dried, I colored on the vase. And when you open it up, it's just a piece of paper folded. You open it up and it says, Happy Mother's Day, I love you, love Tana. So there's a lot of things that you can do with your um, fork flowers and tulips are so much fun. Thanks a lot, guys.